Okay, uh, Assalamualaikum. So today uh, we are going to have a lecture on topic 6, right? And then um, it's, our, it's actually uh, chapter 8 for product services and brands. But then uh, we are going to look uh, entirely for the product and services strategy. Actually, if you have a module with you, then you can refer to topic 5, actually. Okay, topic 5. Then in this topic, uh, we will try to cover for how many LOs here? So, five LOs. Eh? Uh, first of all, uh, we are going to look at what does it mean by define. Uh, you need to know what's the definition of product. Eh? Yeah, or everyone of us know what is actually a product. But then in uh, terminology product, yes, we know it's a way that uh, thing that we can touch. It's an existing product that we can consume, we can uh, have, uh, what we call it, uh, what do you the consumption of a uh, physical product. Okay? And then, uh, then uh, we are going to look at the major classifications of product and services. Then we, need, we are going to dismantle. Okay? Dismantle means that uh, we will divide, we will look at the categories of product and services. Eh? Uh, secara detail, in detail. And then uh, the second LO is uh, we are going to look at uh, the decision companies make regarding their product and services in terms of uh, whether they are going to have a strategies on product lines, mixes, and then uh, we are going to look as well on product attributes, branding, packaging, labeling, and uh, all the characteristics of products that uh, will be tailored with strategies that they are going to apply with. Right? Then the next one is labeling and product support services. Okay. And then a new product uh, development strategy which will be tailored with product life cycle, life cycle graph. Right? Okay. So uh, let's look at this topic. This uh, this uh, PowerPoint. The first thing is uh, what actually is a, a product? Anything a product that we can choose in this uh, market is anything that can be offered. Is offered. Okay, is offered means that we can have an interchange between uh, we we pay uh, money in order to consume okay? to uh, to have a transfer of ownership of the product. Okay. And then uh, we can look at the uh, the acquisition. Acquisition means pemilikan, right? The transferation, the, the the transferable of ownership, and then we consume it. So anything that uh, will be linked with product is actually a value. Right? We always talking about a uh, value. Right? Dalam in marketing, I always said about value. Which is uh, when we consume a product, we pay for money. Let's say you pay for five ringgit in order to exchange as uh, one bungkus nasi ayam. Let's say, then what actually nasi ayam to will satisfy your needs? You want to eat nasi ayam, right? But what actually you expect from nasi ayam? Kita lapar. We are hungry at that time, so we buy nasi ayam for five ringgit. Then we want something nasi ayam that can set can uh, fulfill our what well, is spicy, uh, sedap, you know, from garing panas or whatever, lazat, laziz, and jidan. <laughs> All right? Okay. So that's product. Then uh, we look at the uh, what does it mean by service. Okay, there is a, a slightly difference eh, between product and service. Both are uh, things that are uh, being offered in the market whether it's a product or a service. Okay, uh, if you look at this service, it actually consists of activities and eh, benefits or satisfaction that is essentially intangible. That is actually uh, we've got the, uh, the difference between a physical product and service. Service adalah is intangible, which is will not... Uh, when we sell a service, when we offer a service, there is no such ownership transferable. Tidak ada pemindahan pemilikan as 
we sell a product. When we sell a nasi ayam, then we transfer nasi ayam to them, then they pay us with five ringgit. But then for service, can you imagine when uh, katakan, let's say, uh, gunting rambut, gunting rambut dah dapat kan? Dah, dah boleh gunting rambut sekarang ni. Okay, start from today. Today, right? 10 Jun. So, okay, start from uh, ESO. You can go to Rambo. Then you go to the bar, any barber. Okay, you ask uh, the barber to uh, stylish your hair. So what actually in a return that you will get? Uh, can you, you will take that Rambo with you back? <laughs> no, right? What we get adalah Rambo, yeah? your hair with a very new stylish after PKP. So that's... Uh, we not transfer a product. Uh, kita tak ambil rambut tersebut. But then we have a service. And that's uh, the 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 the, uh, the uh, difference between product and service. Okay. All right. Then the uh, next adalah uh, we are going to look at this uh, physical product. We can actually uh, differentiate, uh, not differentiate, classify it into three levels of product. So the first one adalah the value, the core customer value, the actual and the augmented product. Okay. So uh, you can refer to the slide that I have given to you. Okay. The first one, core, actual and augmented. When uh People buy anything. When we buy nasi ayam, iPad, iPhone, apalagi, whereas car, anything, washing machine, freezer, a physical product. This is actually, a, uh, we buy nasi ayam because uh, we want to eat. We buy a car because we want to have a transport that will commute us, eh? will can it can commute us from one destination to other destination. Or we buy a washing machine because of what? Takkan nak mandi kot. Because of, we want to wash baju, our clothes. So that's core. Core means that a product should able to perform a basic function. Why people buy the product? Beli kereta because of to commute. Buy a washing machine because of to wash baju. Buy a smartphone because of we want to have a call, we want to have WhatsApp or wherever. We buy laptop because of we want to have a, uh, some uh, words on it. All right? So that's the basic core activity. And the core, uh, core, the core function of product. All right? And then people will actually, uh, we can, what about service? That's product, very easy, right? What about service? When you look at this slide, okay, you buy entertainment. Okay? Let's say we go to Legoland. What actually they offer? Hmm? Legoland, right? We don't take anything from Legoland, right? But then we experience an entertainment. Entertainment over there. We go have a ride, night, uh, okay, go to uh, for roller coaster or whatever. Wow, 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 wow. Uh, that's a satisfaction. That's actually a thing that they offer entertainment. Okay. Then uh, one thing about product and service is a core. Okay. Yeah, we buy phone. We buy, uh, let's say, uh, we buy phone. I buy phone. I buy a phone. Okay. Because why I buy a phone? Why I buy iPhone? Why I buy Samsung? Why you buy uh, yo 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 yo? What a Vivo. Sorry. Okay. There is a thing. There is something that we are looking forward. When we buy something, okay, I buy might be not not me. People buy iPhone. It's expensive. It is very expensive. 
uh, how much it will cost you? How much it will cost us to buy a phone, iPhone? 3K, 4K, I think more than that, right? 3K plus. So, why you want to pay for 3K plus just because of a smartphone? You can have uh, a phone, a smartphone for 600 ringgit. Then we can have a talk, we can have a discussion, we can call anybody. We can have an internet connection, we can uh, WhatsApp, we can log on YouTube, we can sing or whatever, we can watch movie. Then why you want to pay for 3K, 4K, it's just for the same function. Answer me? Yeah, you can answer me. This is actually what we call as a self-expression. Self-expression or dalam, uh, you can express it. Uh, nafsu, wants, okay, wants, kehendak, okay, needs is phone, and wants is you need to have something that can relate with what actually you want. The self-expression, maybe iPhone is very small, the 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 the, the, uh, the software is very small, very uh, com co very convenient, very user friendly, productivity and connectivity is okay. So that's actually we call it a thing that we are looking for that will dis differentiate between the uh, uh, unexpensive you know, in uh, expensive products okay? in terms of uh, pricing. Alright, so if you look at this example, uh, why people by iPad instead of uh, instead of uh, tech yeah? as a tech you can have lower cost of that might be 600 but then there is a difference between iPad and other tech okay we can have we can feel it right? the difference between those uh, between uh, this product okay? and then okay Alright, then next under is okay. If you look at this uh, module, you can see that uh, how actually Apple uh, tend to to me to to care of uh, their customers eh, in terms of how to make customers feel that it's worth to buy their product it's worth to 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 spend such kind of value of money with what you are going to get okay so these are like for example here uh, Apple, they have a specific uh, the privilege store. Uh, you will not, uh, you are you familiar with iMachine, right? iMachine. So, it is not only a matter of they sell iPhone, MacBook, iPod, or whatever. Okay? They are actually try to engage their customers with a good experience. Okay? With a good experience of uh, visiting the retail store. When you go over there, you can feel that oh, everything is such a very lively, you know, uh, very seductive, very uh, impressive. Oh wow, you can see that. Uh -huh. So this is uh, what they try to uh, to to uh, to explain to 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 translate life feels good. Okay. Means that Apple say that when you buy any Apple product, this is actually will make will make your life feels better, feel good. Okay, with the design, the simple, the what else, the Ozin style, a very uh, innovative design of product, very quality, high quality. That's why. Yeah? That is why you can see that. 
between Samsung and iPhone, they are heavily competing towards each other. Okay, sometimes Samsung get leader number one, but then Apple still uh, apa ni, tak tergugat tentang dia apa dalam bahasa Inggeris ya, eh? tak tergugat kedudukan dia. Hmm? Okay. Saya nak explain. I did explain about this. Okay, then now we go to the nature and characteristics of service. Yeah? So for product, we have uh, two types of product. Okay? For consumer products and industrial products. Consumer products that anything, uh, any product, okay, any products that the sell to end user. End user means that it's just like us, end user. We use for, we buy for our use. Kita guna, we use it. But then for industrial products, this is actually we buy a product, then we we uh, re, rework on it. Okay? Or let's say for example, we uh, a company, a trading company, we buy and then we make an installation. Let's say a proton, okay? Just like a proton. Proton uh, buy uh, tires, any all components, uh, anything. Then they assemble it to be a car. And then car to their control. Or any pro any company that involve it, uh, they buy a product and then they they. They uh, use it to produce a final good, yeah, a final product. That's an industrial. Okay, so I, uh, I, I think, uh, I think that you can understand it. It's very easy. Okay. All right. Then uh, we go over to types of consumer products. This is very quite uh, important for you to understand uh, the classification of. Consumer product. We have actually four types of consumer products here. So convenience, shopping, specialty, and unsought. Okay, unsought. Convenience means that uh, convenience, muda. Okay. When uh, uh, or we call it as uh, a routine product. Okay, routine product. Since that. We do have to think a lot in order to buy it. I want to buy a sugar. I want to buy a sugar, not a sugar. I want to buy sugar. Are you going to go for it? You know, what kind of sugar we are going to, to buy today? <laughs> okay, you need to think of a week before prior to your buying decision. No. Okay, you just simply, or my, your mom asked you to buy a sugar, uh, to buy sugar. Uh, sugar diabetes. I already finished in our house. Then go to any retail store, any retail shop, buy uh, any sugar. Uh, we have only two choices of sugar right, in our market. Uh, CSR, okay, then you go price sugar. Right? And we don't even think whether we want to have CSR or price sugar. As long as we can see them in the rock, on, on rock, then we speak up there. You don't have to think, oh, how much is it? Because both of them offer the same price. That's convenience. Okay? What is the convenience for them? Toothpaste, magazines, uh, the detergent, salt. Anything, any that uh, involve it, routine. Routine means that we use it. Okay, we use it um, frequently. Okay? So uh, this convenient product actually uh, frequent purchase. Yeah, uh, little planning, little comparison. We don't even compare it. Sh uh, or shopping effort. We don't have to look for uh, any other additional information. To, in order to buy sugar or salt, 
or a low customer involvement. Or you might want to ask uh, any assessment. What kind of sugar? How, how much is it going to run? That's nonsense, right? Okay, but at the back, unless you are a diabetic, you have a diabetes, okay? Then uh, it might be you are going to look at to look for something uh, suitable for diabetic people. For example, stevia or um, uh, sugar cube, right? Eh? Eh? Cube, cube, gula, gula cube. Or uh, what else? Now we have brown sugar. Okay, so that thing might be how. Uh, might need to for you to have some uh, effort, okay? Some effort of thinking, of uh, of uh, comparing when you are approaching your decision. Okay? So that thing become nanti kita akan sentuh for specialty, okay? Specialty. Okay. So in terms of price, basically low to medium price, they say low lah, right? And then the distribution, it's a widespread mass uh, production. They produce as many, as much as they can in order to cater as big as the market. Right? So, so banyak yang mungkin, right? For the distribution and then for the convenient locations. Where can we find sugar? Almost everywhere. Everywhere. Is there any shop, retail store, whatever, where, where, wherever you want to sugar? No. Everybody will sell sugar because things uh, that sh uh, sugar is a thing that people will frequently ask. Okay? Promotion. Do they have, uh, we rarely see or watch any, um, any uh, ads, okay? advertisement about sugar. Do you? Tak kan? Unless now we, uh, they re, uh, we can see really uh, CSR eh, promoting uh, their brown sugar. Eh, CSR that very uh, very uh, suitable for diabetic, that specialty product. Okay? Uh, right. Then the next second one, the second one is shopping. Okay? Shopping product is, uh, all right, what's the difference between convenient and shopping? Shopping means, yeah, shopping. Okay, membeli bela. Uh, things that, basically, um, things that uh, do not frequently occur. Okay, frequently occur. Is it we buy a pair of jeans frequently? Every week, every day. No, right? No sense. <laughs> okay. It might be uh, with, uh, you, you, you are going to visit uh, any Levi store, Edwin or Timberland or wherever during Hari Raya, during any festive, or you have a special occasion, or uh, what else? You, know, you have, uh, you need to replace your, your existing jeans, or maybe you can see that some uh, special promotions on it. Okay? Then we will visit the store. Then, uh, we make a decision okay, to buy a, a new pair of jeans. Okay, so uh, maybe we have a a bit uh, planning, a bit uh, uh, seeking for some information on on that promotion or whatever. Okay, then uh, it also uh, involve with comparing brand. Huh? Okay, a pair of jeans might be the device to blend. Uh, Erwin, what is it? Or oh, a bit higher, guess or whatever, boutique jeans, eh? uh, Playboy, a little bit. Um, uh, eh? Sorry, I always, I, I rarely use Timberland. <laughs> That's not my example, it's a Timberland. Okay? Yeah, lately I bought from Gideon as well. From hush puppies, yeah, they have they offer a very good price of jeans. 
uh, from uh, cotton, cotton on, cotton on, yes. Okay, so I'm going to have some uh, compare and try to compare uh, from uh, several stores uh, that offer the good uh, quality, good price or whatever. So in terms of distribution, price might be slightly higher. Okay, then in terms of uh, distribution, so we have we can see that they have a special outlet or we have they have a, a special boutique right, such as uh, Timberland. Okay, they have uh, they have special boutique for Levi's for Timberland, uh, and then in a mall as well they rent uh, so that they can have um, they can uh, serve uh, to uh, customers over there, but then. Uh, they actually uh, uh, depends on exclusive distributor. It means that we need to apply to be uh, their distributor in order to be able to carry uh, this bag. Okay. okay then uh, the next one adalah uh, promotion. Okay. Promotion in terms of advertising and personal selling. Ada personal selling tak for jeans? No, I don't think so. So uh, then uh, we can see that uh, some people, uh, some uh, products of uh, jeans tend to um, customer selling. Mm. Now I can remember Mac Plarian. You know Mac Plarian? So Vietnamese, right? They come, uh, visit uh, home by home, and then uh, they all just uh, carry a bundle of clothes, and then they just uh, uh, okay, Assalamualaikum, can I have, no, uh, okay, we have a good collection here, then this is a bundle of uh, clothes over there, buka banyak-banyak apa, that's also an example of shopping, uh, to, untuk kampung-kampung, eh, for the villages, maybe they have a trouble to visit to any mall, or um, they might have a limited choice, right? So, McLaren is a very good idea. A very good uh, choice. Okay. Uh, another example. Right? Television, furniture. Seraya banyak lah furniture. During Hari Raya, television might be a uh, very uh, uh, good offer. Or maybe we broke uh, uh, TV kita pecah kalau buka rumah. Eh? All right. Then the, the next one at the last specialty. Okay. The specialty demand is the specialty product is strong brand. It involves strong brand preferences and loyalty. Special purchase effort, little comparison of, of brands, low price sensitive. Specialty cost. Eh? I am uh, I am an uh, Apple product uh, user. When I want to buy any product, I'm not going to easily twist to another brand. Apple lah di hatiku. For example, loyal. When I want to buy uh, uh, any uh, jeans or an apparel, uh, t-shirt or whatever, I when I go shopping, I will strictly try to find Timberland store. That's it. Yeah. So, example. So, uh, this is a kind of loyalty. Yeah, loyalty, strong brand preference. So, we, we, we trust the brand. Yeah. And then, uh, we are not going to compare to another brand because this is, for us, this is already exclusive. This is already the best that fit with us, or the cut, you know, let's say, for jeans, or the cutting, or the uh, uh, comfortable uh, clothes, uh, the names that they have, that they use, eh? and then with a reasonable price. Okay. Uh, for the distribution, yeah, exclusive distribution. Exclusive means that only an authorized distributor eh, can sell the product. Allow if you can see other instead of an exclusive distributor, that's what we call a gray market. Gray market means that unauthorized, illegal. Okay? That sell product illegally. 
That's why you can see that um, some original uh, perfume, yeah, that miniature, right? The small bottle that they sell, you can uh, rarely find the people uh, sell through online. You can buy it with, uh, the, 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 in a box of, uh, in a box of uh, some perfumes uh, that contains original, the original uh, perfume that comes from the small bottle, the right? miniature. Then, uh, it is uh, an original product and they can sell at a more cheap, right? um, cheaper price because of underground, right? grey market. Mm -hmm. Okay, and then in terms of promotion, they uh, target the promotion um, they have a special promotion eh? I always uh, I uh, always receive an email a promotion from Timberland okay? they are seasonally uh, seasoned product eh? from winter uh, autumn uh, winter and uh, winter autumn summer winter autumn summer <laughs> okay, season, right? seasonal product. Okay, then uh, yes, uh, another example of uh, instead of jeans, we can see uh, luxury goods. Eh? Luxury goods are uh, some kind of uh, boutique, uh, boutique clothes. Uh, look at sini, apa dia? Rolex uh, watch, right? crystal, anything. They are expensive. Okay, then the the fourth one is unsought. Unsought means that we do not expect to uh, to buy. We 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 do not plan anything to buy. We just go for a web window shopping, but then oh, terbeli. <laughs> okay, <laughs> terbeli. This is uh, we don't have any knowledge or we don't aware of that we need that product okay we need that product uh, uh, currently we need that product or not but then because of the promotion might be because of the uh, we are attracted towards uh, the person is <coughs> to the person is seller that promote to us then oh yeah oh i need an insurance Oh yeah, why you need a medical card? Do you have a medical card? No, I don't have any. I don't think I need any medical card for now. Oh, that's wrong, yeah. Huh? That's wrong. They say that. That's wrong. Because you know why people need a medical card for now? It's a COVID time, right? We, it's, a, it's an unpredictable situation. It might be us, it might be you, it might be me. Okay? So, so that is why you need some kind of... Uh, medical card to protect you and your family wow then i can see that oh yeah that's good unsought okay that's this unsought so this uh, unsought basically uh, they involve with aggressive advertising personal selling uh, through the uh, uh, i highly contact with customer for example, call a uh, Kobe, Kuku, what else? Jitsu, uh, yeah, one more. Ken, Kenjen, yeah. Do you think Kenjen can just uh, display their product on the right in my den in in uh, any mall? Do you think that is any customer is there any? anyone will come oh yeah i want to buy this 10k water purifier 14k do you think so no unless you will need to promote the product personally go and touch them All right so that's unsolved you don't even think oh why do i need such kind of very expensive uh, tension water purifier for 14k oh my god 
but they managed to make a sale because of from unsought they change their uh, customers mind why they need kenja why they need call why they need a uh, such kind of uh, air purifier air purifier you need to pay 100 ringgit per month monthly commitment why people are willing to pay yes because of from unsought they open they, they they make people understand why they need that product all right i think you understand about it okay Yeah, I want to browse on uh, try to tell you with uh, Maldi as well. Okay, uh, maybe you can you cannot see it so uh, FB live here. And then uh, my, I will give you a recall on this in terms of Uh, the nature and characteristics of service. So services, as you said, that this is uh, intangible. Okay, they have actually four characteristics of service. Okay, intangible, inseparable, inseparability, intangibility, inseparability, variability, and perishability. Okay. Intangibility, we cannot see, we cannot touch, we cannot smell, we cannot test, uh, we cannot taste before purchase. Can you touch uh, any dentist? Any dentist to before prior cabut gigi? No. <laughs> sakit ke tak sakit tak? Then you can have that feeling when the doctor operate do the operation on our face on our teeth eh? because um, then we can we can feel oh this doctor dala handsome right? very touch touching soft touching wow i like him i i fall in love with him <laughs> such kind of thing right then inseparability means that Services cannot be separated from the service provider and consumer. We cannot, uh, we cannot perform the service uh, to, uh, uh, let's say, saloon. You, they cannot perform the service without the customer. Takkan dia orang nak basuh rambut patung. Right. Okay. The, 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 the third one, variability. Variable means that it's indeed, it is not promising, okay? It is not promising that every service that they deliver that uh, we, we experience uh, with will be the same, okay? It means that maybe uh, at that time, the doctor has a problem uh, with uh, his wife at home. Then, oh, what happened to the doctor? A bit silence. A bit fears, emotion to gangu. Then you can see uh, the service that they um, uh, not that very friendly. <laughs> okay, that's a very bad. Or uh, uh, restaurants, yeah, the restaurants. They, even though they have a product, but then when they are preparing uh, nasi goreng, let's say, uh, we, we 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 could not. Uh, expect for today's nasi goreng will be as same as uh, for today's nasi goreng will be as same as what we consumed yesterday. A bit different, right? It's not promising. Some kind of uh, variable. Right? Okay, maybe they have uh, uh, I'm not that fresh brown on that day, yeah? let's say it will contribute to the quality of uh, the end product that uh, they offer. 
Okay, the service they offer. Okay, then the next, uh, the last one is perishability. Perishable cannot be stored for letter, sale, or use. Can we store any teeth? Cabut gigi? No. <laughs> All right. Uh, that service, eh? there's a difference between service and product. Okay, then now uh, we go to the product and service decision in terms of uh, several features, yeah? several uh, characteristics, right? This one. Okay, when you look at this uh, diagram, they focus on this one, two, three, four, five actually. This uh, five elements of product decision, we can relate to that three characteristics of product level. Okay? Core, augment, augmented, augmented, and the third one up there, ah, core, actual, then juga augmented. Okay? So uh, we are going to look at that, how actually they they can be related okay, to each other. Okay? Product attributes, branding, packaging, labeling, logos, uh, and product support services. Product quality, yeah, different people will have uh, different preferences, right? Rambut sama hitam, hati lain-lain, cita rasa lain-lain. Okay, the product quality that we can refer to, the characteristics of product or service that bear on its ability to satisfy, yeah, to satisfy stated or implied customer needs. What we want will be satisfied with, we buy iPhone, then we satisfy with uh, the functions of uh, iPhone. We can make a call, we can make a whatever basic function, call, eh? call, call value, that needs. Yeah? But then when we talk about quality, it is actually more than that. We talk about wants. Okay, we talk about wants. So wants will differentiate uh, differentiate, differentiate uh, product quality in terms of the difference between Apple, uh, between iPhone and other other uh, smartphone. Okay, in terms of the quality of the product itself, the written quality. I mean that. I mean. What I mean is, uh, after same service, the quality level, the performance, the conformance. Conformance is uh, how much actually they conform to whatever specification that they offer. Okay? okay. Then uh, the decision, the decision about features. Eh? So we can, uh, again, we go to uh, an example of iPhone and Samsung. We can see that in terms of features, yeah, yeah, uh, just the same. Both of them are the law. Is both of them are the smartphone that we can talk, we can communicate, or we can carry, we can have the same color, the same function. But then there is a, there are features that iPhone have that, Samsung could not copy. Okay? The tool for differentiating a product from competitor's product. Says based on the value. The value means that why people willing to pay 5K is just only to get a uh, smartphone. 5K will buy your demo the down payment, you know, you can get the creator. Uh -huh. yeah? All right. Okay, then uh, the style, the design. You can see that they went uh, uh, to Elan, the, the, the advertisement of uh, Oppo. Okay, how actually they use uh, Malaysian artist, Nolofa, uh, with a red color of uh, uh, blouse, you know. It's me, I can still remember about it with the ergodynamic dynamic design with the 
very sexy curve, you know, of, of Oppo design with a very amazing color, right? very attracting. I don't know, is it attractive or not? <laughs> yeah. So the design of the product will create to uh, the feeling of uh, usefulness, right? the feeling of usefulness as well as it looks. Okay. That uh, well, it's very subjective. Okay, uh, different people will have different preferable preferences. And then uh, the next one, uh, what the important of uh, decision in product and services is a brand. Okay, is a brand. Why we choose Samsung? Why we choose iPhone? Why we choose Levi's? If we want to buy jeans, we, I'm going to buy Timberland and say, why? So this is a brand, the name, the term, the sign, the design. Why? That's a, uh, a combination of every single thing in one name. So it's just like when we said iPhone, then it can bring our mind to think about, oh, this is something, a very super performance or whatever. Okay, let's say another example is, for example, Toyota, Honda. Then uh, the difference between Toyota, Honda, uh, Proton, or else Mazda, or oh, I use my car Mazda, right? So when people say about this brand, what will come across to them? If you wear, if you use uh, this brand, only those who uh, who is the owner of the brand will know what actually the difference between brand A and brand B and C or us. Okay, that's brand. So brand is actually a product. A product is actually a consists of brand. Brand is actually the name. Everything about product. Can get me. Can you get me? Okay. Okay, next is the decision about packaging labels. Uh, packaging and labels. Eh? We go one by one. Okay, uh, so I, uh, I, I, uh, I like to have an example of IKEA. Eh? You know IKEA, how actually the concept of IKEA, they sell. Uh, do it yourself right? product. Okay, do it yourself product so that every single thing from packaging, the boxes design is all about DIY. Okay, you can have uh, self assemble to it. And then one thing about IKEA is they really uh, uh, concerned about. The, side, the, 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 the recycle. Yeah? So all the product can be recycled as well. All the packaging, all the plastic, the, the, the use of plastic, the boxes, the, 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 the color that they print on the board. Okay? So the color that they use actually can be recycled as well. So that's it. Then, uh, the other thing about IKEA, uh, you can refer to module as well. They have created the Can they have created uh, a special design of ingredient, uh, a special ingredients of a recycled thing to to come up with a very innovative uh, packaging that can be. Uh, recycle as well, which from the eight shelves, you know, eight shelves, collect the load. Okay, the packaging, what else? Okay, then the decision about product support services. This is a bit very important. Okay? Because uh, product support services is, in, uh, is a category in a category of augmented augmented products. People don't see people sometimes don't uh, 
think about it. But then when they have a problem, they will think, the first thing that they will think is <coughs> how actually they want to find the help, any help from, uh, co from a company. All right. So let's say for, uh, I uh, give an example of uh, cars. Okay. Why uh, Toyota, Honda, Proton tend to be very, uh, tend to be uh, the, 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 among the first choice for Malaysia? Okay. Even you can see that between Honda and Toyota, they managed to, to have such what we call uh, 3S service center. Okay, okay. In order to make sure that the after sales services as superb as uh, they can offer to uh, most of to all uh, customers, because for them after sales service after you when you buy a car is such kind of as an important as you want to offer them to buy a new car. Okay. So what happened to, we can, we can see that, what happened to any China, China, China's product? It's really hard to get, uh, when we buy a China's product, it's hard for us to get a replacement, uh, ala ganti, eh? a re replacement goods, if uh, we have problems with it, especially for car. So even though they offer cheaper price, you see? we can buy a cheaper price, we can get a, uh, uh, SUV, let's say, uh, much cheap, uh, much, I think, uh, a bit lower from whatever we can, uh, have been, has been offered by Honda, Toyota, or Proton. Okay, like, another example is, um, Hover, let's say, for example, Hover, you know, Hover is a small, uh, country, Country cross even, you know, country cross SUV. It's only 50k, you know. You can get a car 50k. Formulation car 50k, maybe that but, Right? I mean, a full spec. But then, uh, China, uh, they offer such a price, such a very low price. But then, we might want to think, oh, 10 times before we buy it. How about it's up to say service? How actually they manage to 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 handle uh, our problems, our our comments eh? after we buy that product? How we manage to get all the uh, replacement part? How how fast is it? Okay, or the spare parts? So that's uh, the things that we need to think. Of. Yeah. And then we can see that for other luxurious car. They offer such a very amazing experience to customers. They offer uh, such kind of uh, just like uh, um, uh, launch, you know, launch, eh? L O U N G E, launch a room for their staff, eh, sorry, for their uh, customers. When we go to uh, have uh, car service, let's say, yeah, they offer uh, free water, free. Uh, meals and so on. It's just, it's just uh, you know, to 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 give us as a customer uh, to experience a very the very best, the best uh, uh, experience uh, when we deal with with them. The satisfaction is over there. Okay, then the next one decision is about. Line decision, product line decisions. If you can see that product line means whether we want to have single a single product, only one product, this is what I asked you to do, okay? a single product, or we want to have a single with choices. Okay? Product line. A group of products that are closely related because they function in a similar manner. Right? So, uh, similar functions, similar features, similar characteristics, similar groups, uh, similar what else, uh, distribution center, whatever, price. Yeah, that's a product line, within the same line. Okay, then uh, we have two choices here, line stretching and line filling. 
Okay. So line stretching means we have multiple choice. Just like you can see the an example here, uh, BMW. They offer a series of BMW series three, BMW series three, series five, series eight, series nine, series seven. Okay, BMW six, BMW seven, banyak lah. Okay, so many series they offer because they want to give people a choice, a variety of choices. Okay, so every series. They refer to specific segment, segment A, segment medium, segment uh, low, low to medium, medium to rich, rich apa benda lagi, and then a higher, higher level of, uh, higher level of uh, segment. Let's say for example here, uh, yeah, Dato Shukri Ali, Shukri Ali, eh, eh Ali Shukri, sorry, <laughs> Ali Shukri. He managed to get this Rolls Royce. You know Rolls Royce? How superb its performance. You can uh, see Rolls Royce is actually a technology in producing uh, engine for Boeing, for, uh, for, for uh, I manufacturing a couple of bang. Right? But then now, their, their uh, Pattern car, right? The Rolls Royce. How, how much actually it costs? It costs, uh, I, that to Alif Shukri to buy. I don't know. It might be a million and above. I think so. Yeah, Bentley. So this is a signature, signature brand. Yeah. Very rare. Okay. And then, uh, Product makes decision. Okay. Makes decision can be can have four types of decisions in terms of with length, depth, and consistency. Product means that let's say here for example Colgate. So many types of Colgates. We have Colgate. Tak nak Colgate. I, I, uh, another example. Uh, Sensodyne. For sensitive, gum sensitive, the teeth, ten, teeth, gum sensitive, teeth sensitive, and then for smokers, for cavity, for uh, bad breath, uh, for whitening, for cool and fresh, or whatever. Right? So that's a width. Right? With labor, right? Okay. okay, so that's it for the product and service decisions. So for the service marketing, uh, this one I already uh, touched on it. Alright, so as uh, the last one, uh, what I want to highlight here about labeling and logos, eh? the use of labeling and logos. So uh, labeling and logos is really, uh, it's quite important because when we design our product, we need to make sure that uh, how to have a logo because of what? Because that will differentiate us, differentiate our product with other product with our competitors. How are uh, actually uh, uh, our customers will try to know us to recognize our product at uh, in the market? Yeah, through our logo. The first thing, the first site I the love is they uh, will identify us through the logos list. Okay, so number and logos can be. Uh, anything that uh, attached to the packaging yeah, to identify, to describe, and yeah, to promote. Yeah, uh, an example of uh, of it, like, you know, Starbucks. Yeah? Starbucks has uh, developed 
uh, almost four different types of logos have changed. They have changed uh, the, 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 the logo, their logo, four times eh? since 71. 71, saya tak lahir lagi. 71, uh, they have uh, the first logo here. And then uh, on 87, they change into Starbucks coffee. Okay, and 82, they change the color used. And then last one, they come up with the mermaid. Okay, the lo mermaid logo. Because, in, you know, when they change the logo, it's actually the perspective of their business also has changed. You can see that before the Starbucks has uh, already a uh, uh, well-known offering a very uh, a premium coffee, right? But then, now when we go to Starbucks, they actually offer more than a, more than a cup of coffee. It's a privileged life. It's a lifestyle uh, of being a coffee lover. Then being uh, 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 with their signature drinks. Right? I, I don't know with a far 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 cappuccino or whatever I I don't know how to pronounce it. Okay? So that's the uh, use of logo. Then we can see in uh, Malaysian kids, uh, before this we can um, we hear about BSN also has changed their logos eh? from the use of colors to the uh, a bit uh, turquoise color. Okay? So uh, it might be they involve um, big large cost eh? to change everything to change uh, from one logo to another logo but then it works when they think uh, a logo will help them to promote their product to expose to 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 uh, to help their positioning okay? to position their brands and uh, product and to label them who actually what the personality of uh, themselves about their product so it's all about logos. Okay. All right. So I think uh, that's it uh, for this topic. So I hope uh, you can understand anything about, uh, you can understand what uh, the lecture that I have given to you. So any, any uh, questions you might uh, ask me directly or uh, in a, a Q&A session. All right. All right. Thank you. Assalamualaikum.